How's it going, guys? Welcome to another episode of Spurverts. You know Spurverts, the show where we talk about everything that's got us absolutely excited to be Spurs fans. And this week, it is still hashtag Team Craig. We're still in the building, aren't we, Craig? Craig Attack. Oh, Coming yeah. Coming out here. We are like the new Justice League. That's exactly what we're like. Except we want justice for Spurs. Yes. Um, let's go into the first topic of this week, and it is Ryan Mason versus Stoke mm. City. Now, we didn't win the game. It was 2-2. But Ryan Mason was like the shining light. Yeah. The kind of silver time. lining on our dark cloud at White Hart Lane that day. He was really, really good. He looked dynamic. And I have to kind of admit, um, I was wrong about the kid. I, I thought he should have been dropped and Paulinho should have started a lot last season. Then we got rid of Paulinho. How Mason's still here. That? How could you think that? Because I just thought Paulinho was just all round a better footballer. But Ooh. at the end of the day, it's not about who's a better footballer. It's about who listens to the manager's instructions and gives 100% for the team. Yeah, Mason's one of those players that he's often carrying injuries and knocks that you don't always know about. He's yeah. the type of player that he will go on through the pain barrier. He suffers quite a lot with different injuries. It's kept him out of the, the first team for such a long period of time. And now he has all these little niggles. But yeah. I think he's coming back to his best. He looked I really, so what was well. that match? The, the cup game last uh, season? Nottingham Forest. Nottingham Forest, when he burst onto the scene, we, we suddenly thought, who is this kid? This, yeah. kid's, this kid's great. This is exactly what we need. That dynamism, that, that attacking prowess, yeah. the, the linking up the play, the, the running. And I think we're starting to see that coming back. So I, ho I hope so. Good. And he said uh, in the post-match interview that he needs to add goals to his games. He mm. was frustrated with the loss like all of us, but he said he needs to add goals to his games and he's planning to do that this season. So, Ryan, keep it up and then you won't get any slander from me. All right, the next topic is Balassi and Berahino. Now, two potential players that yeah. may be coming to Spurs. Both very good, both young. What's your thoughts? Berahino, yes. Definitely. Oh, okay. Let's get him in. Well, look, look the, the, the guy has played with Harry Kane at England under 21 level. There's yep. an understanding there already. The guy is a proven goal scorer in Kem. the Premier League. There is Kem. There's Kem there already. And he's just a. Let's think about this. Unji, yeah. Kane, and Berahino as a front three. Ooh. That's starting to sound really nice to me. That's pace, sounding bang, pace. tidy. Pace, pace, pace. That's Those it. three P's. I love Back it. Back in again. I love it. Yeah, or pace and pace and Harry Kane. Ah, Although, yeah, he's, he's not the that. slowest, he's... but he ain't the quickest yeah, either, yeah, let's yeah, be honest. Facts. But Balassi, I don't know. I mean, the, the, the boy's clearly got talent. He's, he's got step overs. He's got the techers. He's, he is dynamic again, yeah. but... I just we'll feel like there's can... a lot of development there. I just there feel is. like he's a bit raw, isn't he? He is quite raw, and I'm, I'm sure he will kick on. But I just don't know whether he's going to become the, the the top quality player that we're going to need. I still think a lot of his crosses don't find the man, and I, I, I just don't know if that's what we need right now. I think we need more of a proven player. Interesting. Let us know what you think. Who do you want? Do you want uh, Balassi or Berahino? Let us know in the comments below. All right. The third topic and the last one is Soldado to Villa Real. Um, <laughs> How do you feel about this? I'm ecstatic, but the funny thing about it is uh, when he was actually unveiled to Villarreal <laughs> and you do that whole thing where you've got to just kick the ball uh, to the crowd, give him a little yeah. bit of a souvenir, welcome gift. Mm. He couldn't even do that. He can't hit the, the target at Spurs. He can't kick a ball into the crowd. He's hopeless right now, isn't he? Well, look, Bobby, but we all love Bobby. Bobby's a trier, you know? And like, he's not a trier. He is a, a trier. He's, he's just a, can't he's just a many, nice guy. There, there weren't many more players or many other players that you really wanted it to work. And yeah. Bobby Soldado was one of those. Every time he was on the pitch, I wanted him to score. Apparently, in training, they couldn't stop him scoring. Wow. They used to say they didn't know why it wasn't working for him on the pitch. He's just afraid of the crowd. Absolutely. Apparently, he was just like razor sharp in training. So, oh, I, just... I, do you know what? Like, it, we had to get rid of Bobby. We I'm did. sad to say it, uh, but I just I wish him well. I hope it does work out for him there. So you're not too excited about him going, but you know, you, you no, did he, want him to go. No, it was time, wasn't it? It was time. Yeah. We we needed to move him on. You know, I mean, if you if you look at the stats, the amount of money we paid for him, oh, how much, much that cost us in goals, in particular in goals in in and not from the penalty spot. Yeah. In in open play, that was big money to it spend. Was. Right. Anyway, guys, this has been episode one of Spurvers. Let us know what you guys think in the comments below. It's not just about hashtag Team Craig. You can join it if you're a Craig or even if you're not a Craig. Yeah. We just want to know your thoughts. Um, stay tuned for part two. Craig Vi is going to be taking that over and we'll see you then. Okay guys, welcome back. Welcome to part two of Spurverts. And it's still, still a Craig attack. Craig part duh, duh. That's right, I said it. D-E-U-X. Anyway, 